German automaker Audi debuted the A6 e-tron at the Shanghai Auto Show, and they plan to produce the model in 2023. An Audi spokesperson reports that the A6 e-tron will start production in 2023, but the rollout process will begin next year. From its initial appearance, it is likely that the car will not be much different from the prototype version, which measures approximately in length, 4,960 mm, width, 1,960 mm, and height, 1,440 mm. The Audi A6 e-tron is equipped with an all-wheel drive system with dual motors that produce a combined output of 469 horsepower, 350 kilowatts, 476 PS, and 590 pound-feet, 800 newton meters, of torque. The car also has a battery pack of around 100 kWh, which gives the WLTP a range of over 435 miles 700 km. Audi has confirmed that it will have several variants, including a base version optimized for minimum consumption and maximum range. They will use a rear-mounted electric motor that can top out at 62 miles per hour 100 km per hour in less than 7 seconds. German premium automaker Audi aims to increase and sell brand vehicles in the world's most important auto market, namely in the Chinese trade market to be able to sell at least 1 million vehicles in China by 2023. Quoted from Reuters, Thursday, Audi raised the number of their trade targets in China, increasing from the previous 726,000 in 2020 yesterday. So said the head of the Audi brand for China, Werner Eichhorn said. In addition, Audi, which makes cars in the world's largest auto market in collaboration with FAO Group, will also add more products in China, Eichhorn said. Audi's rivals include Daimler and BMW. Previously, Audi was rumored to stop producing cars with internal combustion engines internal combustion engines, ICE, or cars that use gasoline or diesel fuel, in 2035. According to Audi, this is considered appropriate, given the trend of the automotive industry towards electric vehicles, and the company will start focusing on this trend in the future. Regarding plans for 2035, Audi still does not provide an exact date for stopping production of traditional cars. But the plan, Audi CEO Marcus Deussmann told Germany's Wirtschaftswache, is that details are coming soon.